the snow falling on Conestoga College's grounds, it's safe to say that winter is officially here. With winter arriving, not everybody has the proper clothing to keep warm. This is actually the first year that we're doing the winter clothing drive. But this is really just an initiative that the, myself and the leadership ambassador team decided that we wanted to, to take on before the end of the semester. We came up with a, a whole list of ideas and narrowed it down to the um, the winter clothing drive and we contacted a couple different organizations in the community and ended up finding out that Sal the Salvation Army is really in need for winter clothing so they were ecstatic when we told them that we were, we were going to run this drive. Well I work at a thrift store and I know how important it is that uh, people get what they need for a cheaper price because not everyone can, cl uh, can afford big fancy expensive clothing sometimes you need the lower range stuff for the low income families. So it's really nice to have something like this to support those who need it. I just think it's a really good way to do something to do something good um, right around the in the holiday season. It's something that's easy to do like people have clothes they don't wear, they have uh, grown out of or anything like that so it's a really easy thing to do and uh, yeah it makes a big difference to people. CSI has plans for next year's clothing drive. Definitely more awareness and promotion ahead of time. This is something, like I said, we brainstormed really quickly. And uh, next year, I think we just want to be able to give it a little more time to put that much more effort into it. So students, faculty, support staff are all really aware that it's going on. And hopefully it'll just lead to more donations. For Spoke Online, I'm Kelly Cottle.